Hi, in this video I'm going to go over the options for LTQ or last traded quantity in the latest version of DayTrader. Now historically LTQ was the way that older domes showed what was trading at each price and we've had a lot of requests to add LTQ as a separate column as it was already de being displayed in the volume profile column but some people felt it would be easier in its own column. Now you can see uh, LTQ here in the volume profile and you can see the new LTQ here in its own column. Now as usual you can shift columns around by dragging in the top row so you can put it where you like. Now in this colour scheme the first trade at a new price will be blue or red depending on whether it's an offer or bid and after that it'll accumulate in white. Now with this option we've made it default to on so when you open a new depth and sales the LTQ column will be there. Now you can of course change your default templates to the colors you like. Now you can set up LTQ in the volume profile column with this checkbox here. If you turn it off there you can see the LTQ is disappeared. To switch the LTQ column off completely you just have to click here on the main setting screen parameters tab. Now this option is a little different to current trades but for those switching from tools like TT this is what they're used to looking at and there is information out there on using LTQ and we'll be getting some customer videos on it soon so thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video